Okay, hello everyone and welcome to a beautiful new video of the coffin of Andy and Lele. Now I got this game on discount on Steam, it looks pretty nice and looks cool I guess. <laughs> I like the character designs and stuff, so hey let's do a little new game and see how it goes. Okay, so we got the controls here, so move, so like easy space. Okay, so I basically full screen F4, so yeah, I, I basically only need my left hand to play this game. Meaning, meaning that my right hand is free. What do you mean by that? Okay, that, that was just messed up. That was just messed up. I'm sorry, that was so bad. I'm gonna regret that. Andy, Lele, I don't... I don't want to. Lele, uh, well I do. I'm not a voice actor, I can do male voices, but... I don't know if I can do Lele's voice. Uh, so... So this is when they were like kids or something. Like, 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 just go over there and K E two U. Okay, whatever it means. I thought she's your friend. Uh, Mom said you'd help me with anything. We'll get in trouble. Tell her they doing. Oh, and then we got Ashley over here. Yep. Good morning, Ashley. Yeah, I know some of the characters already there because I, you know. This game went like mad popular for a while, but I just didn't care enough. Probably because I was extremely depressed or something. Alright, Ashley. Ah! As much as you love feeling sorry for yourself, it is time for a little interlude. It is titled, Find Nutrients to Not Die. Ready, set, go. So we gotta find something to eat, I guess. A V... A v a VHS player cannot be eaten. Yeah, it can. I mean, it's plastic, but... Oh my god, it's white noise. How thrilling. I want, want to be stuck on entertainment like this. Oh my god. I break that TV. I hate that noise sometimes. I open this. It's a cleaning closet. Trash bags and stuff. Okay, I don't care. Washing machine. Got nasty laundry. The freezer is completely empty. Oh, just like my house. Open inside the cabinet is nothing. Oh, great. Junk and unpaid bills. <laughs> unpaid bills. They cannot be. Eaten. Let's check these bags. Probably. This is where you and your older brother pile out your trash. It's already been scavenged several times and is truly. <coughs> And early, so, how is it as a food source? Oh wait, wait, what's that? Got a can of tomatoes. What the hell? A can of tomatoes? What was it doing in the uh, trash? What the? F All right, oh there he is here. Yeah. You show him the tomato can. Ta da! He's just like, okay. Not the reaction you were hoping for. Uh huh. Oh. <laughs> uh, we're not eating that. Huh? No, that's the very last thing we have, actually. I think we should hold on to it a little longer. Quit your complaining. You're energetic enough to go rummaging through the door trash. So clearly, you're not dying yet. How'd you know it wasn't because I hid it there away from you? That's so bad. I live in a den of snakes. Uh, don't rile me up. You're making me hungry. Do you know what would help with that, Andrew, my dear? That. That's a weird thing to say to your brother, but okay. No, put the tomatoes away somewhere. Put them in my mouth, I will. I can see that your heart is set on this. Fine, let's eat them, then screw our future selves. Oh, I guess, I mean... Probably just steal from a grocery store, that's probably what I would've done. And you guys are wondering, what the hell is going on with my hair? It is humid as <coughs> down here. It is so humid that, like, I get clothes out of, like, uh, what do you call it? Like, out of my wardrobe, for example, and they are wet. That's how bad the humidity is here, but it's a little better now. But yeah, it's very humid, so my hair is gonna look a little funny. Okay, I'll be there in a bit. Okay. What is this? In the trash uh, lies your hopes and dreams. 
exactly where they belong. Whoa, holy shit. Uh, oh, that was crazy. Okay. How do we do now? Warden, good day, you're still alive in there? No. Hello, if you don't make a sound of a singer dead. And I uh, don't bring food for the dead. You don't bring food for the living either. <laughs> I'll take that as a yes, still alive. And don't blame me for the delivery guys screwing up. We have something to store for us. Nah, not my job, I'll check in on you again later, bye. No, wait. Wait, come back. He doesn't. Okay. God damn it. Well, that, that was great. Should probably eat that guy. Okay, now that's Jeffrey Dahmer type shit. The balcony door is locked. Why? So what are we supposed to do? Eat the tomato can? So, oh, okay, there we go. Yeah, you boil the canned tomatoes to make delicious boiled canned tomatoes. Oh, nice. There was some pepper left. No salt, though. I don't like salt. Uh, I don't really like it. Salt is like okay on some foods, but it's not really the best. Uh, on like a steak, I guess it's fine. You've used all of it to spike your water in order to avoid overhydrating yourself while drinking to fill your stomach. Well, how is it? At this point, you could feed me a can of worms and I'd say it's the best thing I ever ate. <laughs> Kiss ass. No, I'm saying that's how hungry I am. It is that moment that in a... Um, what, what is that word? I can't even read it. Ominous? Ominous? What is that? Okay. It is that moment in ominous audio assault your eardrums. Never heard that word in my life. Are you kidding me? The neighbor is at it again. Wanna go take a peek? Yes. Nope. What do you mean, no? Let's go be nosy. That's the Portuguese and Spanish people's shit, you know, spying up the window and shit. I can say that because I, you know, I've lived in some countries for a while. Alright, Andrew. But I'll come along if you do. Here, catch. Got balcony key. Yeah, let's go be nosy, why not? It's like the most fun thing, and the balcony was here, right? Unlock the balcony door, yeah, there we go. Alright, oh look, got an ashtray here. An ashtray, there are no cigarettes left to smoke, but it's still good for bashing things in. Yeah, I guess. Mm, can't really see squat from here. You can contemplate if you should take a leap of faith towards the neighbor's balcony. It's on the fourth floor though. Ashley, don't you even think about it. Ah, he's no fun. Guess you'll have to get something up across. I mean, we could use like a little... We could use the table maybe, no? What about here? Your parents have f***ed on this bed. What the f***? Guess check this. Oh! Oh crap, are you alright? Oh my god. These goddamn DIY shelves, I swear. You got a wooden plank. Yo, look, look, we got a wooden plank. There we go. We can use it across, I think. Let's try it. Set down the wooden plank. Yeah, there we go. Now we can be nosy. Let's spy on this dude. They're spying on the neighbor, it's so funny. Ooh, demons from hell. Hear my plea. Oh, the unholy ones, I come seeking your advice. Didn't work? God damn it. What am I doing wrong? I thought that was perfect. I knew I should have killed that guy when I had the chance. <laughs> so that guy is summoning demons in his little apartment. That's that's interesting. What do you make of that? Everybody needs a hobby, I guess. I mean, I, I guess I agree with her on that one. Forget this. Isn't it almost time they let us watch TV? What the hell? 
We don't have TV or something. Let's see. Ah, the remote is dead. Just push the buttons on the TV. Man, what a pain. Oh my god, I'll fetch some berries for you. Always have to want to do everything around here. Yeah, yeah. Woo is you, whatever that is. It is. <laughs> oh my god. Did you find the batteries? This dude is lazy. Damn. Okay, let's find the batteries. Oh, batteries here. There's an old drawing in the drawer. Oh, no drawing. It says Andy and Leia laid and the very, very quiet, you know, capital letters. No, sorry, it's Andy and Leia laid and the very, very quiet. Yeah, I'm not increased. Okay. <laughs> Pick the bears are from alarm. Oh, that works. <laughs> yeah, that works. Yo, step bro, I got the batteries. And you thank you kindly. Now praise me. Wow, amazing. It's such a bang up job. More. <laughs> oh, you haven't sent God's gift to humanity. How did life ever subs subsist you in your absence? <laughs> no one fetches berries like you do. As mm. I stand in awe of your very existence. You sit in awe. <laughs> you should sit too, it's starting. Okay, so we're gonna watch TV now. Thank you for tuning in. Uh, today we share you some joyous developments in regards of the tainted water situation. We're happy to announce that all apartments to which the tainted water has been delivered have been secured. It has it, it has been three months since the first incident was discovered and the death toll is now at a count fee 53 total. That is pretty bad. No biggie. That that that's all that's horrible. <laughs> and the quarantine period for those whom are at risk has been extended by another two weeks again. Oh that's shit. Uh I'll just leave at this point. No fuck it. Uh, go to uh, fucking move countries or something and to our friends in quarantine. Thank you for <laughs> Keeping your disgusting parasite infected bodies far far away from me Wait parasite. I don't think that's how parasites work Fit parasites you'd be dead. I don't think you survived that Three months with parasites. Yeah, you'd be dead in like what the first days or something. I don't know. I'm not a doctor I'm just saying don't parasites eat your body or something Sorry, it's thank you uh, thank you for continued consideration to the public safety. That's all for today. Cheers. I'm going to bed. You decided the same? Yes, yeah, get some sleep. Oh, a dream. Wait, mom, where are you going? Me and your father will be staying at a hotel for a bit. I thought they said that, that we should stay home until I didn't drink anything. Mom, not booze, not dirty, contaminated water, not... The only thing I'm drinking is some orange juice from a carton. Anyways, I'm gonna miss my bus. You and Andrew can join us later. Nurse, alright, this won't hurt a bit. Nurse 16 million. Oh, oh, I hate that so much. <laughs> it hurts like a. There we go. And now you. How long do we have to stay home? The results from your blood work will be done tomorrow. So if everything is well, you're free to. Come and go as you please after that. And if not, then you'll get to see what happens if not. Okay. Let's uh, now take care. Stop calling me Ashley, please. If you need something as the workers there, I can't do anything for you. I don't think those lies about starving anymore. Well, they actually are starving, so. What the hell would I lie about this? Listen, this new apartment is a bit of a. Fixer up her, so I'm really busy. Uh, besides, isn't Andrew there with you? What? Uh, what do you need me to pacify you for? You get to laze around all day not doing anything. Uh, I don't know what you've got to complain about. Anyway, I've got to go. Please don't call anymore. I won't answer. Goodbye, Ashley. I'm sorry. Oh, damn. And my own mom left me. That's great. Okay, god damn it. My hair is a mess. After you haven't seen all night, you wake up as one does instead of putting misery, you decide to clean up the house for a bit. 
Okay, clean up. Picked up some laundry. 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 Yawn. <clears throat> You're cleaning? What a waste of energy. You're a waste of energy. Thanks. Just don't overdo it. Okay. Do we even have any detergent left? I don't know. I don't... I have no idea. I want that jacket, okay. So we're doing laundry now, even though the characters wear like the same outfits. We need to clean this up. Oh, you're not going to get this clean with your bare hands. Yeah. Okay, let's see. There's some laundry here too. We got detergent, okay. You run the laundry. Now what else could you clean? I guess the blood stains on the floor, whatever that is. Whatever this is here. Mop some okay it's dirt. Okay, good. Thought it was blood. Mop some dirt. Oh nice. We're cleaning. How much fun. Oh yeah, the books we you know we destroyed. <laughs> the books on the shelf. What the hell? You're feeling dizzy? Oh, I'm dead. Damn it actually I told you not to overdo it. Oh, she passed out. Oh. Oh yeah, they probably haven't eaten me weeks. They have, they have fucking tomatoes. Good news once again. Some few met with loved ones that there's been a supply shortage in the quarantine households. Yeah. Well, boy, are we pleased to announce that? All of that has been taken care of. It has. Does it look like I'm eating right now? Yeah, it hasn't. On the note, we'd like to remind you not to enter the con contaminated apartments. No, your friends don't need anything from you. Everything is taken care of. Still feel the urge to help. The staff will be administrating bullets directly into your brain as a thank you. Hope that clears things up a bit. Moving on to the next story. A brand new art museum will be... Oh, you go back to sleep. Okay. Who cares about an art museum anyway? <laughs> You're too tired to get the phone. Andrew, hello? Of course, what is it? The shift in tone of the voice makes you strain your ears. No, no, go ahead. Someone is talking on the other end of the line, but you can't make out the words. So we're playing as uh, Andrew now or something? Well, that's, I mean, I can't do anything about that. Or I can try to talk to her, but... No, what I mean, yes, but that doesn't... No, I'm not angry, I'm just... No, I... Can you let me talk? He said, no, it's increasingly loud, but you still can't make out the words. Always about... You don't... Lay and Ashley and... I... Had the time to think, just can't anymore. So that's it then. Well, alright, I guess. What else do I have to say? Sorry? Though I really don't see why I don't... Why I should be held accountable for... Ah. Well, that was... Who was it? My ex-girlfriend, apparently. Oh, she dumped you. Why is that? Why do you think? How should I know? Maybe because you're a person infested? Homebody is apparently perma-quarantined. Or because she found a new... She found someone new and it's been a few months. Or maybe she just didn't like you that much in the first place. Whatever you say, Ashley. Yeah, that was not a good thing to say. That, that was not a good thing to say. Whatever, you still pretend to sleep until you... Until you fall asleep again. Now you've been out for who knows how long. You figured out to check on your brother. Yeah, I don't really like this character. <laughs> uh, kind of like Andrew's like the mature but lazy one, and a Ashley's like the uh, energetic, uh, manipulative, mean one, I think. Something like that. Oh, he's not here. Oh, there he is on the balcony. Someone from your apartment is getting hauled into an ambulance. Hey, me too. People are yelling from the windows and balconies. I need some help too. Please, I'm starving. Someone's losing a hurry. Follow me surprised they actually got that person some help. I feel they just let her die. Maybe she did die, she wasn't moving. 
Probably. As if they would have their sirens playing for a corpse. Oh, true, that is true. They don't uh, play the sirens for a corpse. Then what do you suppose was her emergency? No idea nobody showed up when you fainted. Well, did you call for anyone? What do you think, dumbass? Uh, I don't know. Maybe she went into labor or something. Yeah, maybe. Think they'd bring me food if I got pre- Nope. Let me finish. How would you even get pregnant in here? Well, we do have that one charming fellow next- right next door. Over my dead body! <laughs> the cult dude? What the hell? The, the guy that was summoning demons and failed? Over my dead body, yeah. He seemed a, a little off his rocker, so who knows? He, ju he just might end you. Forget this. Okay, he's pissed. Well, excuse the hell out of me for exploring my options here. That one didn't look pregnant anyways, wherever it's just a thought, jackass. Oh my god. You'd like to go after Andrew, tell him it's none of his damn business anyway, but you're just too exhausted. Okay, he's been sleeping again, for maybe a few days, who knows. Bursting of energy. Yeah, oh, I am tired as hell, just go back to bed, screw this. Oh, blacked out. Oh, you silly lazy bones. Andrew, you're making so much noise. What the hell? What is he doing? He has unscrewed the lock and is attempting to kick the door in or out, depending on your perspective. Okay, so the door's uh, barricaded from the other side somehow. Uh, what else am I supposed to do? Warden. You don't stop making that goddamn door and bring it in the food tonight, goddamn sons of bitches! Sorry, I tried to do a redneck accent. Okay. <laughs> you won't either way. Says you that delivery will be here in a matter of hours, but I guess you don't want anything. Yeah, that's right. Now you better stop bang, bang, banging that door. Next time we'll be banging your head against the wall. When steps fade away, do you think they'll actually get the delivery today? Like, I didn't fuck up to this for us. Unlikely. Though I guess we'll see. And see you did. That absolutely nothing was delivered. Yeah, pretty obvious. <laughs> Bro's just like, oh, what the fuck is wrong with me? Uh, uh, talk about something. I got nothing. Try. So, parasites. It's been a few months. Are you feeling anything? Hunger? You'd think something would have happened by, to us by now, but I haven't noticed anything. Yeah, that is true. That's all. So, this is a little weird because parasites will actually hurt like shit. Uh, you'll. Puke blood, probably. I don't know. Uh, I just know that it's gonna be painful as hell. That's what I know about parasites. It's gonna be painful and uh, and horrible, you know. So they they don't have parasites. It, that's weird. I don't get that. That nurse never came back either. Like, don't you want to monitor us? Uh, who cares? Me, Ashley. I care. Well, I don't care. Nor did I. You care. Aside from starving, it's not so bad here. Come again. How do you like it here? What the hell? Except from starting, I like it here? How? Well, I don't. I wanna- I wanna jump off the balcony. Ooh, I'll race you. Ha <laughs> ha! No, seriously, let's go. Let's not, though I appreciate your eagerness to join me. But it's a bit too romantic, I'll soul pass. Excuse me? What, you don't see it? Just imagine hitting the ground together. And with such force, our bodies turned into a pile of gory marsh. Never to, never to be separated, our remains would get so tangled up, they'd have to bury us together in the same coffin. Oh, so that's why it's called the Coffin of Andy and Lele, okay. Might as well have been confined together in the coffin of an apartment, which feels like an attorney already. I'm not jumping off the balcony with you, get your head checked. I should get my head checked. And no wonder your girlfriend dumped you if those are your plan plans for romance. <laughs> that is so bad! <laughs> no romance, I said romantic. They're not the same thing. Yeah, that is true. Romantic just means something is... Oh, the neighbors again uh, with the music. And he starts blasting his favorite ritual music. For all to hear. Oh my god, he's doing rituals again? Again, I wish he just... God damn. 
Okay, yeah, we should check on my. He just summoned the demon, I think. I think he did it this time. We heard something. Yo, did he summon a demon this time? Let's check. I gotta try that sometime. Cultist, my lord, you've come. And you're uh, a little smaller than I imagined. I... I love it. It's better than I imagined. That's all I meant. What do you offer, human? Oh, well. I don't, I don't have much to give you right now. But if you help me get out of here, I can get you anything you wish. Is that no good? As you wish, human. My lord, thank you. Thank you. Perish. Darkness clouds your vision as you cannot see what is happening. By the time your vision returns, the entity has vanished. On the ground lay the lifeless body of the cultist. The hell he just died! Look at their faces, they're like, what the f So, uh, am I already delirious or did you see that too? Do we, uh, do you want to check on him? Well, at the very least, I want to turn off that CD player. Yeah. That's what you're concerned about? I am not listening to this for the rest of my right. For the rest of my life, Andrew. <laughs> you make it sound like we're going to die any day now. Well, aren't we? Well, I'm not. There should be something this guy has that we can eat. Ooh, burglary time. He's already dead. Sh shut up and uh, let's get in there. Alright, let's go in here. Door number 20. Okay, so we gotta get the door in. Okay. Okay, so we gotta find a way to uh, smash the uh, door in. I, it, it's a glass door, so I think you can just ashtray. Yeah, I think this is gonna work. Door unlocked. Yeah, just smash the glass. And just put your hand in there. Okay, so now we uh, turn off this goddamn CD. There we go. That music gets annoying. After a while. That's a little meat, you think to yourself. What? A lot, apparently. Do I mean... Is this illegal if we didn't kill the guy? Is what illegal? Well, you know. Oh, you want to eat him. <laughs> I, is it that what you were in, in saying? No, I was just making an observation. Ah, but we can't. If we... If we do eat them, then that's it for us. There's no way we could get out of- There's no way we wouldn't get caught once they finally let us out. It's not like we killed the guy. Yeah, messing with a corpse is actually a crime, yeah, that is true. Well, I think this should look past it, since they give us nothing else to eat. Uh, well, the staff will admit that they didn't give us food though. And before that, we're gonna taunt them, a demon killed them, really? That old fly? You were taking the hell out of this. Well, just eat the body and hide it, I don't know. Are we doing this or not? I'm expecting an answer. Uh, yeah. Alright, fine. Let's find something to butcher him with. Oh, what can I... Oh, well, time to do uh, Jeffrey Dahmer stuff, I guess. Oh my god. Yeah, time to commit cannibalism. Is that even a crime, I think? I don't know. I, I think it is a crime, yeah. The bathroom smells of feces and you feel zero. Oh my god! This dude is disgusting. If you eat him, you're gonna get an infection, alright? Let's check the fridge. It's empty. Got a cliver. Oh, nice, we got a cliver. I don't know if it's cliver or clever. I, I have no idea. Big enough to hide in, okay, so we can hide in the closet. So, uh, you get the arms, I'll handle the legs. First, you chop off the cultists. Right arm, left arm, right arm. Oh, uh, it's disgusting. Oh, I don't want to watch this. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. Come on, be open like this. Just be quick about it. No! Can you go get some plastic bags or something? I'll take care of the rest in the meanwhile, I guess. I'm counting on you, Andy. Don't call me that. You hand him the clever. Alright, so he has the clever now, so... Uh, uh, I'm gonna get some plastic bags while he's chopping up a dead body that we're gonna eat. 
Ah, this is gonna be an interesting episode. First episode and we're already committing crimes. <laughs> Broken the glass door. How it feels to chew five gum. Oh. Stimulate your senses. I didn't need to see that. You got left leg. A small problem presents itself. The plastic bag big enough to fit the whole torso in them. Crap, I don't think we can cut to the spine either. Just fold them over. I don't, I don't think that's going to work. Watch and learn. The dead cultist. Oh my god. Yeah, see, if anyone happens to be looking out the window, it'll be a disaster. Maybe just use two bags. This isn't going to... <laughs> the way she just starts laughing at a dead body. God, no, don't make me laugh at this. I don't have the power to make you do anything. <laughs> oh, and ignore my hair, please. It's a bad hair day. It's very humid down here. I don't have the power to make you do anything, Andrew. <laughs> all right, all right, enough. Uh, gather the limbs up and go. There should be plenty enough room uh, for them in our freezer. I'll stuff the torso and head in the freezer for now. Go cook us something while... <laughs> then I'll go cook us something while you're at it. Yeah, you'll cook quite the some something here. Yeah. Oh my god. Got right leg. Right arm. Left arm. This dead body there, that's so bad. Alright, well. I guess we committed cannibalism on a dead body. Ah, the freezer, yeah, there we go. Now which one do you want to eat? Oh my god. So I don't know about this guy's uh, limbs, like my arms are like very thin, so like... I would say the leg has more meat or something, so I guess right leg. Alright, time to cook. Oh my god, this is disgusting. You fry some meat. Dinner's ready. This is disgusting. <laughs> right, so well, what are we having here? Pure deliciousness is what? Eat up. Oh, so she is a cannibal, but he's not. You first. Munch, munch, huh, what? Oh, she did. You already- Okay. Eat, Andrew. You will not waste this. Why is she so mad? Um, right. Andrew takes a bite of your cooking. Yeah, he's gonna puke, isn't he? I don't think he likes it. He begins retching. No, you don't! <laughs> he fucking grab his face! <laughs> What the <laughs> Swallow <laughs> all of it. Go okay he did Oh my god. Well well how is it? It's God I hate pig it's it's a human I made this with love <laughs> you lick the So you're not leaving the table before you've licked the plate clean. Quit your nagging woman. <laughs> Then quit your gagging, you pig baby. I'll, I'll eat her, right? Just give me a damn minute. You watch while he slowly finishes his plate. Good boy, I'm so proud. Weird thing to say to your brother, but okay. Uh, just fuck off, Ashley. <laughs> what an odd way to say thank you. Yeah, yeah, thanks a bunch. I'll clear the table, so leave me alone. Spices left, what do you think I should try next? I don't know, maybe... I don't know what that is. Oh, I'll try it tomorrow then. I'm off to bed now. Night, night. Yeah, good night. Okay, there we go. Uh, so far the game has a very interesting story that is like kind of like a I don't I don't know how to say it. Like, it's a nice story. What was that by the way? Oh, coffee machines. It's long, sad, and abandoned. Damn, you can be some rounds of coffee in the sounds. Yeah, okay, no more coffee. Okay, so, yeah, just go to sleep. You fall asleep, fully content with your life decisions. Interesting life decisions, Lily. Said she likes you. Oh, so this is when they were kids again. This is like when they were like, what, six or something? Andy who? My friend from school. Or at least I thought she was a friend. So are you going to be her boyfriend? Gross, no. Haha. -ha. I should teach her a lesson. You're my brother mine. Oh my god. 
Well, she's probably just jealous, I guess. Uh, I'll make her think twice before stealing from a little woman. <laughs> oh yeah, you're a girl too. What's that supposed to mean? S somehow you don't count as a lady in my mind. Or as a person for that matter. Screw you, I'm the most personist lady in the world. So anyway, I'm gonna take her to that old warehouse and lock her in one of those... One of the cr crates. Yeah, yeah. Seriously. Mom gave me some money to go buy groceries. Are you coming with? Focus, Andy. Let's let's leave her sitting there all night. That'll show her. That's messed up. Let's not. Yeah, let's not. That's that is horrible. He he. You should go ask her to hang out. She won't say no. Then, Lele, I don't I don't want to. Yeah, just go over and ask her to come with you. Take her to the warehouse and we'll see what happens. Come on. Mom said you'd help me with anything. I thought she's your friend. Well, I thought so too. And she can be my friend again afterwards. She needs to a reminder how to do it proper. That is so bad. Uh, Andy, we'll get in trouble. Yeah, you probably will. I'll only let her out when she promises not to tell on us. That, I don't think that makes it better. Do it, Andy. I guess. Hooray, you're the best. That is... It's, Today's episode is titled Andy and Lele the <laughs> the box. <laughs> One day you'll be a <laughs> in the box and your friends will take turns pissing on the ground above. Damn. What do I do about these seats around you? What does that mean? Where did you learn these words? Yeah. The bitch is you. I'll take you out to play, and, and when I'm done, it's back into the box with you. What the hell? I really ought to kick your ass one of these days. <laughs> Alright, Lily. What is taking him? He wouldn't have forgotten our plans, would he? So, uh, oh, finally. <laughs> what are you doing here? Surprise, I want to hang out too. Oh. I mean, I guess that's fine. Say, did you tell your mom you're here? No, why? Hee <laughs> hee. Why did she laugh like that? Hee <laughs> hee! Just wondering. I mean, I'm surprised she let you come hang out with a boy. No way, she thinks I'm about to study with Julia. But why are you here, Ashley? Divine intervention. What's that even mean? It means she's full of crap, don't listen. So are we going inside or what? Is that allowed? I allow it. I have my mustache. I allow it, let's find a way in right now. Okay, so uh... Steel mallet. I can't really think of a mouse in this situation. I sure can. Let's get in the warehouse. Yeah, okay, in that case, no. I don't wanna know what you had in mind. What are you talking about? It's nothing. Let's keep looking. What about this? Why'd they nail this metal sheet to the wall? Looks like there's a hole behind it. Perfect, tear it open. What? I can't do that. It's okay, I won't tell anyone. Okay, before everyone goes crazy and is trying to wonder what the fuck am I doing? If you guys don't know, when I'm sitting on this chair, I do this a lot. You know, I go back and forwards. And if I'm playing with my hand, okay, it looks so bad. It looks like I'm doing something else, but I'm not. So I have my right hand, right, which I don't need in the game. Uh, I usually have it on my mouse. But I, I, I had it like this, so, you know, like that, right, on my mouse. And I'm using my left hand, right? And since you guys only see my left hand and you don't see my right hand, I was like rocking back and forth in the chair. And, oh, it looks so bad. It looks like I'm, you know, doing something, but I'm actually not. So, yeah, if you guys are wondering what the hell is this, well, this is something that I do when I'm like, you know, sort of energized, when I have like caffeine or when I'm just bored or something, because I have, um, a mental problem. I don't know. The doctor said it was uh, ADHD or something. I don't know what the fuck it is. Okay, I, I ignore it. You know, I, I like to stay away from doctors and shit. <sighs> but it was like months ago, and his doctor told me that shit. It was years ago. I mean, fucking idiot. Ah, it looks so bad. But yeah, if you guys are wondering what the fuck am I doing, I'm just rocking back and forth, and it it, it looks like I'm doing something else, but I'm not. I just want to put that out there. <laughs> 
It's a mental disorder that I keep rocking back and forth and it looks like something wrong, but it's not. It looks so bad. And I had a lot of caffeine when I was recording this video, so I'm like editing right now and I just saw that. I didn't even realize I was going back and forth. Anyway, enjoy the rest of the video guys and sorry to bother you with this. <laughs> As in literally, I can't do it, dumbass. Not without some tools at least. You know it's this flimsy? Yeah. I... I like smart guys over beefy ones, who asked? Got hammer. Oh nice, we got a hammer. There we go. Now we can smash this. Oh, you used the hammer... Oh wait, wait, you used the back of the hammer to pull out the nails. That's actually pretty smart. Oh, there we go. That's easy. Cough. Wow, it sure is cough, cough. Uh, kind of dusty in here. Oh uh, yeah, you probably... There's probably some mold, you know? You, you might get sick, you know? Makes me worry about my asthma. Oh yeah, you're probably dead. It's fine, it's fine. It's not. If you have asthma, don't do this. Uh, oh, I know. How about some hide and seek? Oh, you're such a kid. Huh? And he wants to play too. You do? What? Oh, yeah, sure. See? Well, I mean, it's fun every once in a while. You totally want to play too, you child. <laughs> yeah. I'll be it. I'm gonna count to ten. 100, count to 100 at least. Okay, okay. One, two. Right, let's go find a good block to shove right in. I don't think this is gonna happen. Still want to do that. Of course, she said no one knows she's here. This is perfect. Lele, you promised. Now hurry up before she's done counting. That is messed up. So, uh. Oh, there's a box here. Crate can't be closed. Containers fall. Let's check this one here. The big box here. Oh, now this will do. There isn't any lock on it though. Well, we don't actually want to lock her in. The hell we don't. Place a stick or something between the rings. That'll keep it closed. Won't the stick just break? No, well, if she's hunched inside, I doubt she'll have the leverage to. We are not here, I come. Oh crap, she counts too fast. <laughs> Wasn't that fast, really. Let's hide, let's hide. Yay. Okay. How about here? Oh yeah, they can't find us here. There's any speed. Okay, so just like a random stick. I guess this'll do. Yeah, that, that can kind of work, I guess. Just very stupid. Well, what do you think? Is she pretty? The stick? No, what do you think, dumbass? Ah, she's fine, I guess. She's mad. <laughs> uh, oh, she found you. Both of you. Who finds the same spot, idiots? <laughs> it was my spot first, then you're it. Double count. My hiding spots are the best. I know a really good one for you. Come take a look. Um, okay. Oh my god, I can't believe we're actually doing this. No way. I don't think a game would like let me do something like this. It seems like a bad idea. How so? I'm gonna get my clothes dirty. <laughs> Didn't say anything. My mom does. She'll get mad if I... 100. Oh, she's coming. Hurry, hurry. Uh, okay. <laughs> Slay your friend hops inside the crate. Oh, what was that? Yeah, I got you now. Still need to throw up the lid. What the hell? <coughs> Coughing. Uh, this isn't funny. Actually, let me out. There you are, Andy. Andy, slowpoke. Hurry up. She's putting up a fight. Cough. I can't breathe. Cough. Cough. Is she all right? Please, I- Ah, oh, this is messed up. There's no way. Shut up and- Shut up already, drama queen. Let her out lately. She's just pretending. No one's ever died from some dust. Uh, with asthma, you can. Uh, cough, cough. Come on, just let her out. What, you'll believe her over me? It's not. It's really about whether I believe her or not. Fine, you let her out. Who cares about me anyway? Cough, cough. Everyone likes her better, but bet you like her better too. Why is she being manipulative or something? What the hell? 
She, she's let out the freaking coffin box already. God damn. Uh, bet you'd rather have a girlfriend than spend time with me. Of course she would. Oh, come on. I already told you I don't want. And I bet... Oh, she's crying now. I bet you only hang out with me because mom told you to. Well, that's... I mean, maybe she did. But... <laughs> the hell? It's not fair. Why does everyone like her better? Oh, shit. That is true, kind of. I'm loud and weird and annoying. And no one likes me at all. I like you better, Layla. Prove it, liar. Uh, knew it. Maybe you, you would have more friends if you weren't always so. Not even my own brother picks me over, <laughs> over her. I knew it already. Did I not just say? <laughs> Talk sure is cheap. God damn it. Actually, oh god. Oh, there's no way. There, are you happy now? Hee <laughs> hee, yes. Oh, that is messed up. That is messed up. Uh, just, just until tomorrow morning, okay? Yes, yes, you do. Best, I like you best, Andy. She's gonna die, isn't she? You hear that? You could stay here until morning. No, please, cough. Actually, let me out, cough. That is messed up. Actually, actually. Oh, that's bad, bro. Actually. Are you awake? I am now. Ugh, I'm just stretch real quick. Uh, okay. Uh. Yeah, okay. What is it? Nothing, it's just... God, what the fuck did we do? Still on about dinner? Fine, just starve then. More for me. How are you like this? Are you out of your mind? Listen, I didn't kill the guy. So I didn't do anything wrong. You mutilated and ate a corpse. What else were we supposed to do? Call the warden to tell him no he died? Um, yes, yeah, sir. He summoned the demon and didn't die. I swear we didn't do it. Uh, yeah, that doesn't fly very well. Yeah, we didn't have to admit we were there. And we could have we could have just uh, told him to go check on the guy. Andrew, what the hell? What? What's what the hell? Didn't we both agree on this? I could have sworn it was your suggestion in the first place. Ah oh, well, now you're not hungry anymore, I guess, so that's... <laughs> no, that's some bullshit, but fine, not as assume it was, so... What do you want me to do ab about it? I... Whoosh, whoosh, there goes my magic wand. There, I've absolved you of your sins. You never took a bite now, you're welcome. Well, gee, thanks. We'll see how that holds in the face of law. <laughs> Listen, who cares? He's groaning now. Isn't this like uh, some extreme circumstances stuff? Like, we can't be excused, it's not the water company's fault. First, they lock us in for months, and then they won't even feed us. And is cabin fever a real thing? Maybe we can plead insanity? I don't know, Ashley. <laughs> Damn. So, there, there. You know, I, I can. Get his head off, huh? Like he didn't fit in the freezer proper. Oh! Oh, that's nasty. So I needed to chop his head off, but I couldn't. His spine was too... Anyway, I kind of just... Kept cutting around and pulled it off. Like... Like some plant, I don't know. I keep thinking about it. I can't fucking sleep, actually. It's... Come here. Okay, I don't understand. Okay. I don't know what's wrong with you. How are you so unbothered? I don't know, I com compartmentalize, whatever that is. Kind of like we compartmentalize the guy into different freezers. Ashley. <laughs> Andrew, what is it, Andrew? Andrew. Sh she's uh, poking him. <laughs> Andrew, <laughs> poking him again. Andy. Ah! <laughs> the scream. He bit her! <laughs> okay, that's funny. And ah, I hit my arm. I told you to stop calling me that. We're not kids anymore. And then why are you crying like such a baby? I'm not crying. Where, where, mommy? The big bad me did the evil thing. You shut your whore mouth. Make me a little bitch. Forget this. 
here in the room where we used to go on adventures, what? Any of Lily's quests for something or another, remember? Why bring this up? Isn't this just another one of those? I don't know. Probably not. I don't know if uh, cannibalism is something... An adventure. <laughs> can you just play along for now? Don't worry this crappy situation, then we can unpack it all later. Or... Or not. Uh, I don't think uh, I will personally. But you can go to therapy. <laughs> Like, I could tell a therapist what I've been up to. Alright, just a thought. Yeah. Let's just get out of here like we should have done months ago. Now that we've got food, don't you want to keep waiting until they let us out? Hell no, I don't. They throw us in jail right after. And I know which is worst. Withering in this coffin of a house or getting railed in prison. Ah, so you want to escape not only this quarantine, but the cons of your actions as well. Preferably, yeah. Yeah. This episode is titled Andy and Lily, the escape from the coffin. Yeah, whatever. I'm going to sleep now. Good night, sleep tight. I'll try, good night. Alright, they're going to sleep now. Love you, Andy. Shove that Andy chunk up your ass already. <laughs> I don't love you that much. You make me want to kill myself. Too bad diving down the balcony is just too romantic for you. A pillow hits you in the face so hard you see stars. Haha. <laughs> okay, so uh, your body absorbs some nutrients and you're feeling better. Okay, that, that this were, wait, what the hell? Is that a note? There's a note stuck in the door that reads Awaiting the arrival back at the cultist's lair, Andy. I knew he'd come around it. I always thought it was gonna be a suicide note, oh my god. Well, no matter, let's see what he's up to. Alright, so, the cultist slayer, what is he doing in there? Hey there, good morning. What you up to? Looking at this demon summoning instruction manual book thing. Brave given things turned out so well for that cultist guy. Mm. Debatable, I mean, he was successful up to a point he lacked an offering. Anyways, it says here that demons don't think much of humans. Well, that's good, we'll have something in common then. Yeah, yeah, so... They're only willing to do business as long as it's quick and easy for them. I take it you want to ask, uh, want to get us out of here? Well, I wouldn't want to get out of, this, out of here the same way the cultists did. But I do think this is our best bet for now. So what will we ask from it? I don't know yet. Okay, then what will we bargain with? I don't know, I, I don't know that either. Nice. I just barely woke up, give me a minute. Since your demons prefer human souls, so obvious it's gonna be that. Where to get soul while stuck in here? The warden maybe, like the cop dude? What are you looking at? Oh, nothing. Ashley? What, I wouldn't... <laughs> Tell about it, I see. Let me keep my thoughts to myself. Don't we already sure enough? On second thought, let's not do this. Oh, come on. Oh, fuck, I skipped that one. Oh, uh, we'll figure something out. Let's... Let's just uh, set the ritual up for now. What is it, what's it needed? Not done reading yet, but you can start by replacing the candles for now. Okay. Alright, I'm back. I went to go eat. So yeah, now we have to light up some uh, candles or whatever. I'm sitting down in a stupid position, so like... Got two candles. <laughs> uh, one candle. Fuck. Okay, I got one candle and two, three, so... One goes here, one goes here, and I guess here this... Th th these uh, melted candles look like things. Replaced candle, okay, there we go. Uh, all right, done. What now? Now we. Uh oh! Still alive and kicking, are you? Uh oh yeah. We... <laughs> You've been quiet lately, pal. I'm getting a little worried here. Uh, yeah. Hi. Hello. One of my guys isn't answering. 
the weirdo one. I think he croaked, but he's just a B type anyway. Fine, I'll check it after my round. The warden's footsteps move away from the door. Is that all we would have had to do to get the door open? Just shut up for two days? Oh shit. He's gonna come in and see all this. No, 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 no. Oh, he's nervous. Enough. Go stall him at our door. I'll clean this up. He's still gonna find the guy missing. Unless he checks the freezer, which is where all this blood is pointing at. No. <laughs> Go for he knows there's no hole, All right, and keep him until I've mopped up all the blood. Maybe then he'll uh, assume the guy jumped off the balcony or something. There should be a corpse below them. You got to be that or you you get to be that corpse if you don't get going already. Okay, so. Did the liquid clean? Okay, so we gotta get a mop, so... Let's go get that real quick. Hurry up a little. And yeah, Andrew's like stalling. No, no, listen, it'll be a trade. I told you I'm not interested. I've got some good books in here. I'm sure you'd like to read them while you off, okay? <laughs> I... I thought you said it was fine literature. Oh yeah, it's, it's real fine. Like how? You'll see for yourself, I'll trade you one book for a pack of noodles. We'll exchange them via the mail slot. But maybe it's a genre I don't like with a sample. Like hell I will, did you want me to get in character too? I didn't want to go into this blind. <laughs> I don't want to go into this blind, who knows what kind of crap you're reading. It's just one pack of noodles, don't be such a coward. Actually, I think each book is worth one of those multi-packs at least. Is it? You're such a problem. One book for one pack of noodles. One ten pack. Push them in. Oh, one ten pack. Push them in one by one. Then you'll get the book. Listen here. You're the one. It, I'm the one holding the cards here. You said what? Watch me not. Okay. What the hell are they doing? Oh my God. You. All right. Let's go. Also get the mop, yeah. Back to the crazy guy's house. Clean, 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 clean. Clean this, clean that, and this and that, and this and that. Ashley, the warden is coming. Oh shit, hide in the closet, hide in the closet. Oh, that was a, I should've, I should've hit in the balcony, cause then I could've just went home. Greetings and salutations. Uh, oh, I messed up, didn't I? Huh? Anybody home? No, oh, he's pissed off. Oh great, another suicide. What the? How did you get in here? Oh. Well, that works. That actually works. Oh my god. <laughs> Sorry about that. Actually, not, not saying anything. <laughs> well, that, that worked. Yeah, that was something. You wonder if it's a good time to tell them none of this it's your fault? <laughs> Come on then, Laylee, let's go play. Okay... I, I thought I got caught there. You did? Yeah, you did. Happens to the best of us. Oh, well. Now you got a dead body. Does he have anything useful? He's very dead. Oh, well, you've done it now, Andy. You've actually killed a man. Like, directly. Yup. I was a little surprised there. <laughs> so where's your mental breakdown? I'm saving it for later. Lay off. Yeah, we'll see how you sleep after this one, huh? Actually, I'm not in the mood for your shit right now. I... Oh, looky here. You got a key to room 405. Oh, let's get the hell out of here, finally. My god, we can leave. What is this? The door's... Put in the check in the pockets you find a wallet with 666.66 bucks inside. Wow. Split it with Andrew. No, aren't you a sweetheart? You got 333 bucks. 
I'll use some of mine to treat you something someday, maybe. Oh, there we go. So we split the money. That's nice. Oh, at least you unlocked the door and... Before we go, Ashley. Huh? I just want to make sure we're on the same page about something. Whatever excuse we had for eating that, that other guy just went out the window because of your screw-up. Oh, I'm sorry. Did I ask you to kill him? What do you think was going to happen if I hadn't? Look, I'm not saying I'm not grateful, Andrew. I am. But what's your point? My point is that no matter what happened beyond, beyond this door, you, you, you won't speak i I'm dyslexic, okay? Speak, speak a word of what hap what went down here to anyone. Yeah, obviously. Obviously. And it'll no doubt be obvious we uh, did something once this guy's shift ends and the next one comes looking around. It's best we disappear while we can. Well, as you might have noticed, I'm trying. Yeah, see, I'm not sure you're grasping the gravity of our situation here, knowing you. You think you're gonna find mom and dad. But I'm saying all of that uh, is off the table. I haven't planned anything yet, actually. God, it's even worse. Okay, so we're in contact, I know, ever again. Uh, because you take those snitch on us to the authorities, is that it? Uh. Yes, exactly. Yeah, fine, whatever. If you're going to be this flippant about this, it isn't the authorities you need to worry about. What's that supposed to mean? Are you threatening me? I'm not going to jail because you think of yourself as in... What? What is this words, man? Impervious. What is it? I don't... I can't, I can't even read that. To consequences. So you're going to take this to your grave even if I... Even if I have to put you in, in there myself. You don't scare me, Andrew. <laughs> don't give me a reason to. Andy, it snows in hell the day I'm afraid of you. <laughs> She's slapping him. No, back the fuck off. Who do you think you're talking to? Yeah, he's just worried, I think. It's... I'm stressed out lately. I can see that. I need to know you're taking this seriously. There's half a dead guy in our freezer with my fingerprints all over it. Trust me, I'm in no hurry to tell the world about it. All good? Can we go now? Yeah, I guess. Okay, finally. Though, Andy, what? I don't give a red sass about mom or dad. Or any of my so-called friends anymore. None of them felt it was necessary to even answer my calls. Or come fling food up for a balcony. That is true, so yeah, they're all fake people, basically. Would you... Wait, did he throw something so high? The point is no one even came to try. Yeah, that is true. So my affections officially died with all the brain cells I lost while starving. <laughs> but it's alright because Andy is here with me. Even though he feels like threatening me for some reason. Sorry. I guess I lost some brain cells too. Can't lose what you don't have. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> alright, alright. Let's uh, get the hell out of here already. Alright, so it's 401? Oh, there's... Okay, it was 405. Okay, get him to 302. Another key here. Surveillance camera? Crap, are we on it? No, I think it's a recording of the second floor. Oh, let me see. Great, there's another warden there. Is it a gun holster? Yeah. Oh, let's go shoot this guy. Nope, he only had a key to the cultist room and a walkie-talkie. Oh, well, that sucks. <laughs> think there's a warden on every floor? Nah, they probably work in pairs. It's not like they have to do anything else than uh, keep curious people away and pretend to feed us, I guess. Well, even then, how are we getting around him? Don't ask me. Ah, yeah, there's a key here. For floor key. Okay, nice. This, it's the toilet. There's nothing interesting inside. Okay. Oh, what is this? Have a couple of noodles. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> This is all it took to keep us in a wooden board. 
It's okay, Andy, I don't have much muscle either. Here I see you trying to comfort me, but your words say the opposite. Ah, whatever, what's the slip of paper say? It says 2XAB. What's that supposed to mean? Don't know, don't care. Yeah, let's just focus on getting out of here. And now we can go in our house. Okay. Nothing interesting, I guess. And uh, nothing here as well. Elevator is broken. Third floor. 302. Oh, there's a person here. Yo, 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 what's up? I'm breaking and entering. Hey, hey, hold up. Don't you dare come any closer. <laughs> Who are you? Your neighbors from upstairs? What are you doing here? Get out! Well, we found the keys and thought you might want to get out of here. You talk wrong, get lost, huh? What don't you understand? You don't want to get out of here? That's what I said, uh, why would I want out? I get free food and can play games all day long. The hell? I look like a king, I hope this quarantine never ends. Wait, what? They actually bring you food? Of course, literally anything I want. All you gotta do is ask nicely. Like, bend over and open wide nicely. Ashley! Fuck you, get out, both of you. Okay, uh, we're gonna get out. Okay, I'm sorry about that. <laughs> well, that was something. How come? You got to do the treatment. Why don't I get food? I guess she's not pretty enough. You think she's pretty? I mean, wasn't she? Whatever. Is it okay to leave her there after she saw us though? No. Okay, she'll definitely scream, yeah. Okay, <sighs> she's so hopeless. <sighs> Finish the ritual and use it to get rid of the second warden. Hmm, well, if we can get this woman to help the cultist room, we've got a sword to offer. Beats me, let's just finish setting up the ritual for now, alright? You really think I'm not pretty though? Oh come on! So ugly am I? <laughs> that I shouldn't even be fed? Or maybe they think it'd be fun to screw you while I'm loading around the house. What the hell? Oh yeah, okay, fair point. What the hell? And I wouldn't let them anyway. <laughs> okay, what? Other oh, chill, okay. Check here, anything I missed? Not on the fridge reads. Notice from now on, A, B types won't be given supplies except if it's someone important. And no, the lady from 302 being hot doesn't count as important, stop asking. The hell? Well, that makes some sense. Yeah. So we gotta finish the um, rituals now, or whatever the hell that was. For us, big deal if I were screwed anyway. <sighs> we call the warden. Oh, this demon in his soul. It's not a bad idea, actually. Two birds, one stone. No coming guns blazing, alright. We take walkie talkie. Ritual for us. Thing to do. I don't remember. Check the guidebook. Okay. So what's needed to finish the ritual? So draw some runes on the floor with blood. Not sure what's what runes though. I'll just redraw what the guy had already drawn. They seem to work. Okay. Ah, oh, you dip your your digits in one of the warden's runes. Oh my god. Oh, it's nasty. Well, we make blood though. Make little drawings of blood. That's fun. I have an idea. Oh, I said the lady downstairs lure uh, the warden up here with the walkie talkie. And then how are we going to make her do that? You know how. Yeah, Alright, let's go convince her. Or was there something else he still needed to be set up? Just lighting the candles and turning on the audio. Okay. Yeah, we want to keep the demon waiting. 
Alright, so we have to go through some messed up stuff now again. Ah, what am I up to? Go to the third floor. Oh yeah, we're back, don't worry. Looks like someone gave up some of the furniture. Oh, who cares? You two again? Sorry, sorry. There's one last thing we forgot to ask you. What? I thought I made myself clear. Oh, huh? what do you want? Hey, get off me. Oh, well, now she can't scream. <laughs> What's going to happen now is that you'll coo into this walkie-talkie. Huh? Tell them that you and his friend are looking for a good time up in room 405. I, I don't understand. You only need to understand we'll slit your throat if you don't play nice. No, no, please. I'll do... I'll do it. I'll tell him anything. We'll see. You press the walkie-talkie on. Hello? Huh? Who's there? Hi, Dave. It's me. Where's Malcolm? Uh, Malcolm's here with me in room 405. Is you a cure for a quick visit? Quick visit, huh? I mean, if you want to have a good time, that is. <laughs> well, I'll be... Well, I'll be... Well, well, I'll be, I'm always up for a good time. <laughs> you know what I mean. <laughs> what is... What is... Was it... Was it? Okay. Was it room 405, I guess, that we were really croaked? Uh, <laughs> nothing. Uh, I'll be right there, sweet cheeks. Oh my god. Alright, good, let's go. I'll let, her, I'll let her go for now. The I can't read, okay? I have, I have dyslexia. Uh, I'll let go for now. What do you think she'll do? I won't do anything, I promise. Go finish. I'll keep recording until it's done. What? Get going, dumbass. Fine. Okay. I almost forgot Lily Catch. Oh, lighter. Yeah, that's needed. You already finished the ritual. Yeah, let's go do that. Ah, oh, yeah. Candle. Candle, candle, music. There we go. Maybe some a demon. Who are you? I can't see. Yeah, I like this room. Who? <laughs> uh, you are asking me my name, human. Uh, what do you offer? Yeah, like, should I mess up? I don't want to pay for its name. I'm here. Kinda dark, huh? I'm not doing it with this kind of music on. Let's... Oh. Shook. The warden reaches for his gun. Ah, him! I offer him! What? Ah. Oh, that's an offer. Did he like... So, uh, well, how is it? Human with tar-colored tar soul. I give you this. God, small object. Interesting. Hold it for an occasional. Can't even read that dream. To, uh, goss the troubles ahead. I guess. Thank you. The entity has left, and you're still alive. Unlikely, the other ones. Man, that happened way too fast. In the end, I didn't get its name or ask a favor. It did whatever it wanted. And it definitely just gave me whatever trash it was laying around in its demon pockets. But no matter, but no matter, the warden is dead and uh, if I have to... What is that, Claire? I'm not even gonna try to read that. Uh, dream, that'd be cool as hell. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Yeah, uh, like I said, I'm extremely dyslexic. Uh, you say to linger, which was a vicious pitch black mass. I guess you already knew that. Oh, that's not that bad. So, let's check. This one had a gun, right? I'm gonna take that. You got kid on the second floor. Gun. Time to shoot Andy. <laughs> Just kidding. I'll probably shoot the lady, though. Why? Oh, well, we can get the hell out of here now, so... Exit. Third floor. Was it this room? Yeah, there we go. Oh, he killed Sleep Prince is splitting the lady's brains with the wall and her corpse regrets in the bed. What happened here? She tried to shoot me with the nail gun. 
How on earth? I, I thought you were holding her in place while I let go. Why? You were taking a while. I figured she wouldn't start anything as long as I had my clever. Lesson learned. <laughs> How interesting. That you'd want to take your chances with that. For no reason. What are you getting at? You did say she was pretty. <laughs> oh my god. I didn't try anything with her. Yeah, yeah. And here I was wondering why you insisted on staying behind. Andrew shoots his load while I risk getting shot by the warden. Are you unaware that the lady is dead right now? I guess she said no. Oh, that is messed up. Screw you, Ashley. I almost got shot too. That's your own fault for letting her go. God, I can't believe what a dumbass you are when it comes to women. For the last time, I wasn't trying to get with her. And even if I had, which I didn't want, which I didn't, so what? Uh, she's dead now. Uh, okay, that makes it fine then. Good to know. God, I hate it when you, uh, when you get like this. What's your problem? Fucking every time. Every time indeed. Every time some fucking floozy comes around. Yeah, I mean, celebrate. What's it? What's it to you? It's always the same with you. You get to dip your t <laughs> in some <laughs> and the rest of the world disappears. Not true. Yeah, it is cock brain. <laughs> now is definitely the time for this. I just, I just need you to get your priorities straight. My priority right now is getting out of here. Your priority should be me. <laughs> the hell. Blow it out your ass. I'm not having this argument here of all places. I... No, shut up. I didn't screw the neighbor lady. And on the note, will you back the fuck off my love life, Ashley? What's that supposed to mean? Oh, I don't know. It's not like my girlfriend dumped me after you harassed the hell out of her or something. Oh, she told me what a tattletale. You're better off without loose lipped whores like that. So it really was you. That's messed up, Ashley. That, that, that's messed up. Uh, yeah, all I did was weed out a quitter for you. You're welcome. And I wouldn't harass anyone if you'd stop ignoring me when I need to. That That's that's pretty bad. You always need something. You always have some bullshit crisis the moment I'm supposed to meet with someone. Bet you bloody love it here when, where I can't as much take a piss about you knowing. Uh, and I bet you'd love it. If I killed myself, then what the hell? Where did that come from? Fuck that, I... Fuck, fuck. <laughs> uh, what a prime example of your... You, just you. Yeah, uh -huh, you would, you would. I know it already. I'm right where you want me, huh? I'll do it then, I can, just for you, you know? I have just a thing for that. Back. At your back and call just like it was back when. What? No, screw you, Andrew. Don't act like I'm the bad guy here. I never wants me to do anything. It's always I don't want to. I don't want to with you. Well, answer me this. What do you want then? <sighs> well, see if you have, if you have listened to a word I said, you know I. Why do you want to spend time with me anymore? What, you don't want to spend time with me anymore? <laughs> I've done nothing but spend time with you for the past three months. So then why aren't we friends anymore? Uh, of course we are, just... Forget this, can we just go? Just what? Just go. No, answer me. What were you about to say? St Stay that I'm going. No, no you don't. What's so bad about me? I've been looking out for you, isn't that what siblings do? Just stop. What? Talk to me. It's not my fault. I didn't lock us in here. I didn't kill the cultists. I didn't even kill the warden. Which one? Neither. You did. And the demon. <laughs> I'm all innocent. I've not harmed a single soul. Uh, well, Andrew's ex-girlfriend, she did technically harm someone, so, kind of. Of course not, you you make me do it for you. I didn't make you do shit, Andrew. You chopped the bastard up all by yourself. Wow, oh, she crazy. Uh, And you chose to do everything you've done here. 
And guess what, Andy? Don't. You chose to lock in that tray. Where the fucking cunt showed. <laughs> Try yourself to sleep to that, Andy, my poor Andy. That is messed up. So that just came out of your mouth. What is true? You chose to do it. And you chose me. You chose me. <laughs> oh my god. You backpedaling fucko for brother. You chose me. You did. You did. Ah! Now he's choking her. Interesting. Uh, so I guess we're not leaving here together. You can't do it. Haha. <laughs> you won't. You can't cuz I'm the only one you can talk to. When you can't sleep at night and you can't take it. I'm the only one who can make it go away. Fancy that when you're the reason I can't sleep in the first place. I would like to go now with Andy. I'm ready to go now. Go like did? Of course not. I I want to leave this apartment before we get caught. With you, can we go? Yeah, I'd like to go too, but the thing is you're pissing me off so much right now. We go now and you'll just throw another fit later. Yeah, I probably will. I'll make such a scene too. Yeah, so I don't know if I can risk it. Maybe I'll just end you here and be done with it. Though if you can come up with a compelling reason not to, I won't. Well, I already said, there are sleeping pills for that. What the hell? I didn't expect this today, goddamn. Ashley. Yeah, okay, I got nothing. But I'd like to go with you very much. Though if you plan on ditching me anyway, then fuck you. Uh, if it's not going to be just the two of us, then you forget it. And he let go. Cough. Okay, yeah. I'm gonna shoot. Choking. I don't... Uh, give a shit about... I'm glad she choked. I know you are. No one knows it was us. Oh yeah, the little... Uh, when they were like kids, they killed someone. Yeah, that was messed up. No one knows it was us, so what does it matter? As long as it's just us, are you saying you'll behave? I'll behave if you behave, isn't that how it goes? Who knows with you? <laughs> Though I'm assuming uh, we're getting the hell out of this place. Yeah, that's right. Our quest continues. What did we name the episode again? Andy and... Okay. I'm not gonna be Andy anymore, huh? He's so spineless, and I hate Lele with... Like you wouldn't believe. Huh? <laughs> she better stay and die here with Andy. So you and I can leave. Fine. Whatever that means. I, I like you, but you're so exhausting. <laughs> Nonsense, I'm in <laughs> the hell. Okay, let's leave and never revisit this conversation. Yeah, I've got the keys to the second floor and the warden's gone. Surprised you didn't shoot me yet. <laughs> Maybe later. <laughs> Now let's get out of here. Finally we can leave and there's a dead body. Dead as stone. Some magma. Can we take this? Nail gun. Can we take it? No, okay. Alright, so we're in the second floor now and we can escape I hope. No, can't open none of the doors. Uh, look, an open window. Great jump. Tempt me not, Andrew. I mean, it's only the second floor. You really don't want to take your chances with that. Damn, isn't there like something we can rope or uh, something we can use to climb down? Probably. Wait, what? What if we climb out the windows, uh, down the windows, the carpet? I'm not sure how we're going to secure it though. You hold it while I descend. Oh yeah, and then I'll just jump into your arms once you're down. Would that actually work? Maybe if you catch me instead? Hell no, it won't. We gotta set up something, hold the carpet while we climb down. Nails maybe, from the nail gun we found? Let's leave it by the window for now. Okay. The two of you use the nail gun to nail the carpet into the wall. It doesn't look safe. There has got to be something else. I'm going for it. Yeah, screw it. If nothing else, maybe the carpet slowed my descent down. I mean, I guess... Alright, you first then. No first time. <laughs> okay. 
you climb down the variant lady like all right there we go oh we both did it yo we escaped hell yeah so what happens now well what happens now is that we'll skip town and then find a buffet restaurant Ooh. then we'll steal someone's identity or something to continue our lives easy peasy huh and then as long as we never come in contact with law enforcement we'll live quiet life and die You've got it all figured out. Good god, I have no idea what we're going to do, Ashley. Alright, skipping down a buffet, okay. Let's go to this location. Maybe some traveler dropped their ID. And the place using that, I'm sure we'll find some grunt work somewhere too. I even then I don't think that's going to shut your mouth, shut your mouth. I don't know, it'll work at least. Live under a bridge or something. Like trolls. Oh, we'll eat those who don't pay the toll to cross. <laughs> now, can you laugh? It's anything but funny. How can you do anything else but laugh? Everything is going to crap. <laughs> Keep it together. I am. Let's start by catching a bus. Okay. I'm happy. I'm happy to be out of here too. And otherwise, I'm a hero away from a panic attack, thanks for asking. I didn't get to tell you before, but the friend I called while you were downstairs gave me a gift. Do you wanna know? Supposedly, I should be seeing visions from the future in my sleep now, but who knows. Well, I hope you do, it wouldn't be handy when it comes to finding certain things. It would, yeah? Yep, so you can relax a bit, I'll keep my sleeping eyes open. But that also means you can't leave now, you're stuck with me. Nothing new under the sun. <laughs> stuck, huh? How are you? Yeah, completely stuck. Aw. <laughs> uh, I don't laugh at it. Okay, you get on the bus and drive the hell out of here. Vroom vroom, motherfucker. End of episode one. Oh, finally. Wanna save or something? Yeah, I'm gonna save the game and end the video here. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed episode 1, uh, I'll do episode 2 tomorrow or something in a few days, uh, whenever, <laughs> whenever it uploads. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed episode 1 of this uh, little game series I'm doing, and I'll see you guys next video, goodbye.